Yo, what's up, my the soldiers? It's Typhlosion Explosion here, and welcome back to part 33 of our Pokemon Lunar Dark Let's Play. In the last episode, we we were told by a professor by the profess, professor Pinewood that about Team Solar and Team Lunar's potential goals, like what he discovered, and he also told us we should be heading off to Rasic City because there's like a temple there, I think, or there's something there, and we also encountered. R Rick on our way here. And we also got the Salam Slam might, so we can now once we get the Mega uh, Mega Ring, uh, we could have Mega Evolve Salam Slam. So yeah, we made it to this like little cave. I forgot what it was called. But this should take I think it's called Rassic Pass or Ancient Pass. That there that's what it's called. There's nothing better than a walk through Ancient Pass. So yeah, we're gonna try to get to a uh, Ancient Pass in this episode. And maybe if we we're lucky get and evolu get a a mega sal slam and here is golemo and that's the evolution of that golem pokemon we've seen a couple times whose name can i cannot remember right now but we're gonna just brick break it to the face i did a good chunk right there it's gonna be stone edge jeez stone edge i think this thing's a rock ground type i don't remember if it's rock ground or or it's uh just pure rock. I think it's rock round, but Jewel Well Well Tall. It sounds like oh it's this thing. It's the it's the evolution of that I forgot what it was called. It was that jewel spider Pokemon. It was a bug rock type, that's all I know. Or that's what all I can remember. Um Scrabble, I think it was called. Yeah, I think that was what it was called Scrabble. I'll check the Pokedex, but interesting. Ruby Ops gonna finish both of those off. Cosmet. I think it's that uh if I'm not mistaken, could it be that one? Oh no. Cosmet. It's like a rocket. That's an interesting Pokemon. Kinda cool actually. So it was like what is this? Like a rock electric type? That's what I'm gonna say, just cause it's it, it looks like it has like lightning in the like shooting out of its uh propeller thing. I don't know. Keep walking. Hey buddy, I'm walking here. Um I'm going to try to look for that uh Pokémon. I think it was called Scrabble. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was called Scrabble because I remember the board game. Scrabble. I know this is like super like, you guys probably don't even care, but I I don't know. I care. I want to see. I want to see there to Scrabble. I remember that name just so well. And, you know, let's. We should probably put someone up front. Let's put up uh, Werehide. Werehide hasn't been getting a lot of action lately. Let's heal him up. And uh, here's another one. Do you know the history of this place? You would. How about you tell me what happened pokemon ranger tamina and glowfalk every time i hear this thing's name i can't just i, I chuckle and it looks like we're kind of starting to get a little under level people uh, a lot of pokemon are starting to catch up it's gonna be thunderbolt come on where i where i took that like a champ but yeah a lot of pokemon i've noticed are starting to catch up in levels didn't give us exactly a level jewel jewel tall let's uh Rock, uh, bug. Let's send in Scorpionip. And let's use our flamethrower. Or actually, Earthquake may have been better. Thinking back to it now. Well, that did a lot. <laughs> Power gem. What? Wow. I thought that was a crit that almost took us down. But we, we're gonna get a crap ton of experience. Eclipser. This was what I was. This is the evolution of Eclipo. That's actually kind of cool. It's like a. It's literally like an eclipse. But it's actually extremely bulky. And it's gonna take us out. Okay, that was not to be expected. Um. Hmm. Let's send in Petrovolt. And use. Lightning strike. Strike it down with our lightning. 
That was kind of dumb on my part because this thing has power gem and I, I saw that. Okay. We're kind of getting our butts kicked by this Eclipo. Okay, let's send in Pixelily. And we're going to take it out. <laughs> that was not good. That was actually, like, bad. Yeah, she, uh, Tamina, you're kind of a tough, you kind of are a tough cookie. Okay, so I've noticed, so I've been saying this for a little bit, but this last play is coming to an end soon. It's like after I defeat the grass-type gym leader. Because I know that's the next gym, like the next gym, that's when the demo ends. Also, if you guys have probably were wondering, like, why I didn't upload on, uh, Friday was because, I guess, because, like, the episode I was trying to record, I didn't have time to work on it, or, like, edit it, so I just had, I just didn't get the opportunity, so that's why it was, I didn't upload it, because it wasn't finished, and I didn't have any time to do so, because I was, like, really busy this, like, last week, a lot of school stuff, a lot of tests essays just it was a busy week for me but hopefully since christmas is coming in like a couple weeks i will um be able to take a break and this thing's just being annoying healing up another thing is uh a future video is going to be my review of pokemon ultra sun and moon which i haven't started work on it but i will try to get it up by this month if if I and I will definitely be working on this like over Christmas break, trying to get it done. Because that's just how what I want to do. I want to do a review of the game. Give you guys my honest thoughts. And yeah, it's gonna be a spoiler review. Because I feel like I can't review the game without going to spoilers. I just can't. So if you wanna watch that, that's what you will be expecting. Could expect for the next couple weeks. There's this boulder, and I need strength, but it's like I gotta teach it to someone, so... Who here can learn strength? I wanna see. So, pretty much only Sal Slam and Rubiop. Let's see what Rubiop has. Let's get rid of Takedown. We we never use that move. And there's just no point. Let's just teach it strength. And if anything, I could always remove it later. Okay, let's uh push this big boulder. I'm telling you, Sun and Moon just really helped us out with getting rid of HMs, and it was only an iron. I kind of was hoping for some really cool, really kind of cool, a cool TM, but I guess that didn't end up happening. Whoa, a Tomatro. That's a cool looking Pokemon. Yo, I want to catch it. Oh, wait, this is an electric steel type, right? Yeah, um, never mind. I just defeated it. It's the evolved form of Atomics. Electro Ball? Petrovil wants to learn Electro Ball? Hmm. The faster we are. You know what? Let's get rid of Volt Switch for now. And just keep Electro Ball because we have a TM for it anyway. So just in case if it's. If Electro Ball is not that good, we can always like just. Teach it that instead. And let's put a. I want to put a Pixelily just because. Um, Pixelily hasn't been getting a lot of action. And there's our friends, Kira and Rodney. Sorry, did I disturb you guys? Did you want some alone time? Ah, it's you, Lunar. I'm glad you came. Have you seen anyone from those weird teams? No? Speaking of which, who the heck is that? Sorry, I need to get through. Who the heck was that? Rick? Ah, uh, you guys again? Did you see this guy, guy with spiky hair run through just now? Um, yeah, who is he? He went running that way. Move out of my way! Uh-oh. Looks like, uh, some troubles afoot. What was that about? I wonder who that guy he's chasing is. Maybe Rick needs help. I hate to say it, but we should follow them. Maybe that guy is part of Team Solar or Team Lunar. You could be right, Kira. Let's go. Well, okay. Also, Rodney, stop hitting on my girl, bro. Bro code says you don't do that to your bro. Bro. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so stupid. Come on, don't do this to me, Pixelily. Okay, we're gonna just... Okay, that's gonna use Aerial Ice and just destroy us, right? Yeah, that was a crit. Well, that's unlucky. Oh, come on, really? You can't let us escape? 
Now you let us escape. I hate it when you can't escape a battle like you want to. Okay, I'm just going to use this max revive. Like you want to escape, but a Pokemon just like yeet and just doesn't let you go. Oh, come on, really? Okay, maybe uh, putting Pixelay up first wasn't the best idea. Okay, this was dumb. Why'd I do that? The same thing's gonna happen, no. Okay. This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna switch into Petrival and then Ron. And then I'm gonna put up a Repel. Because these Dracubats are annoying. That was a waste of a uh, Max Po. Max. Uh. Max revive, and we'll put up a max repel because I do not feel like doing dealing with any more of these wild Pokemon. Wait, Luna, they're they're over there. Ooh, we're spying. Hey Rex, I'm Rick, the brother of Rassic City Dragon Master. Lizzie, I challenge you to a battle. Oh, is this the dude in the Elite Four, Rex? Lizzie's little brother. Ah, uh, yes. Rich was it? No, it's Rick. <laughs> oh, sorry, but I'm in a hurry. I have no time to talk. No, I want to battle right now. I'll show my family. No, I'll show everyone that I'm strong enough to beat you. I really don't have time, but how about this? You will battle your sister, and if you beat her, I will, ha I will happily accept your challenge. Wait, that's Rex? He's in the Elite Four? Huh? Who are you three? Never mind, I have no time to talk. I'm searching for some people in strange uniforms. Have you seen anyone like that around here? What do you mean Team Solar or and Team Lunar? What, you've heard of them? Yes, we've encountered them a few times. Pro Professor Pinewood sent us here to look for them. Professor Pinewood? Professor Pinewood? Really? Then he must trust you. Will you please help to find help me find them? What was that? Whoa. Oh, uh-oh. We both have we both have what we want. So how about you and your little minions disappear, Derek? You may have the crystals we need. But we had the Volstone, and we need it. And we need of it. Hand it over now. <laughs> Do you really think I just hand it over because you asked? And who do you think you're talking to? Do you think I'd be the soon enough to bring it here with us? I thought you were smarter than that, Derek. Ooh, shade. Roasted. Grr, never mind. We have what we came for, but be sure, Starla. This isn't the last time we meet. We will get the Volstone from you. I highly doubt that, but that's all for you now. But that's all for now. There's no point in continuing this conversation. Come on, Bright Gloria. Let's go. Stop. What are you doing here? Who are you? Wait, you're Rex of the Elite Four. What do you want? Oh, and he has those meddling brats with him. They will be easy. There's more of us than them. Let's take them out. This is where you kids meet your end. They want a battle? We'll give them one. You four, help me out. Battle the commanders. I will take care of both leaders. Ooh, I'm battling Gloria. Still as cute as ever. Still as cute as ever. Papyra. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, that's the... That's one of the... Um, that was one of those little puppy Pokemon we needed. The guy in the side quest asked us to get. So it's a fairy fire type. That's a really cool typing. Not really a typing we've... Many people have seen yet. Actually, we haven't even seen it yet. What are we? What am I talking about? I was really hoping that uh, UB uh, Burst or like Blaze Cephalon. I thought I was hoping it would be a fire dark, a uh, fire uh, fairy type because that would that's like the typing we have not seen yet. And that's a pretty cool typing, if you ask me. A fairy on fire sounds like it'd work. It's gonna withdraw and go into Durferno. Whoa! But that was not smart because you kind of switch into an earthquake there, buddy. I love how the little puppy Pokemon took an earthquake better than Durferno. Durferno. Papyro. Um, let's go into Sal Slam. Our ace. And let's use Aqua Tail or Surf. I kind of just wasn't really paying attention to what I was clicking. Jeez, that does that gives off so much experience. Blitz will work. Oh, I had a feeling it was this thing. I didn't even think it evolved further. Guess I, I guess it does. It's like an, it's like, that's like crazy. It's like an entire like thundercloud now. Let's use bulldoze. 
Oh, it has levitate. I was wondering why this thing didn't have levitate before. Now it's going to use cosmic power. Buff of its defenses. Let's just use rock slide. It's 47. That's so crazy. Our, our Pokemon are so under leveled now. It's just going to keep using cosmic power. Why do you keep using cosmic power, dude? Don't just stop bulking up. Maybe we get a crit? Nope. But it's almost done. Let's use camouflage now. Now it's a rock type. Interesting. Well, let's finish this with Brick Break. Salsum's gonna grow to 44. We're gonna defeat Gloria. We, our order will rule over Rakoto. Not on our watch. Oh, you stupid kids really make me mad. It's not important if we win or lose. We have the legendary crystals. That was the one. That was the one and only time we will help Team Lunar. Now we will get all five elemental stones together and revive Solar Ren and bring our new order to the region. I will make sure you don't get that far. We will get the stones in. Lunero will bring our chaos. This is not the end. Our mission will succeed. Smoke screen. It will take more than a member of the Elite Four and some, and some brats to stop our plans. Flash. So we met the leaders of both Team Sol Solar and Team Lunar. Oh, 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 this isn't good. We will, we still beat them, but what are these crystals they're talking about? We have won this battle, but we haven't stopped our plans. The crystals. We shouldn't talk here. I'll head back to Razak City. Meet me in the ancient museum. I'll tell you what I know about them there. But first... What is that? Is it one of those, uh, stones? They didn't take the crystal. They must not think it's important, but I think it may be used to us. There is nothing more than you could do now. Thank you for all your help. You are the very talented trainers. Maybe one day we will battle at Rikoto League Village. A battle? That's what I want. I don't care about the crystals and these stupid organizations. I will beat you, Rex, and I and will show the world how strong I am. I will go to feed my sister, and I will show you, Rex. And for you three, catch you later, losers. Dude, he's such a jerk. He really has a fire in him. Again, thank you for your help. I will see you soon. Well, that was interesting. This is all getting too deep. We should leave this to Rex and the Elite Four, or even anyone stronger than us. I think so too, Kira, but what if they need help? We shouldn't run away. Wouldn't it be horrible if we back down and those evil teams succeed? I guess you're right, Ronnie. I, all right, I'll do it. That's a spirit, cure. We'll beat them. The world is in our hands. Yeah, in our hands. I, I'm not going to battle Lizzie though. Lizzie, though. I don't really like dragons. Even if it's not a proper gym, I'll still battle her. How about you, Lunar? You too. I knew it. How about tra a training battle in Rastic State before we battle Lee's Lizzie? It'll be a good warm-up. Yeah, perfect. Okay, while you guys do that, I'll go to the Ancient Museum and look around. See you later. See you later, Lunar. Wait, aren't we supposed to battle the Grass Gym leader? Maybe... Maybe not. Maybe they changed up the order. I don't know. Well, I'd hate to end off... End off the plate there already, so I kind of would like it for... It's to last a little longer. Glowfock, Pixel Lily. Okay, let's send in Scorpinip. Gonna use Thunderbolt, but we're immune to that. We take it like a boss. It's gonna use Slam Burst. We're gonna take the easy. Okay, that does a lot, but we have Earthquake. So the next gym is either the grass type or the or the um dragon type one. Dra Dracubat. So this will be perfect for Petrovolt. Let's try out our new move. Electro Ball. Well, that was a one shot. Okay, that was powerful. But yeah, this game's getting pretty intense now because we're getting to the real plot, plot stuff, the nitty gritty of the plot. Dust ball. Oh, we're not out yet. I kind of expected that was it. Okay, I'm not complaining. 
This kind of almost reminds me of like almost like a bit of a victory road. Look at my. Okay, this they're gonna use dragon types, and we don't really have. Actually, we have Sal Slim's Ice Beam that could be pretty good. And oh yeah, we also have Pixely. What am I saying? Wingon. Yeah, I don't think this is the best matchup for Pixlily. So we'll send, we'll uh, keep in Petrovolt, but we'll send in Sal Slime because he has Ice Beam. We're going to use Electro Ball. That does a lot. Okay, they're kind of all, ta they're kind of teaming up on Sal Slime. Not really the best. Teal up Sal Slime. Let's uh, use. And then we go after that Wingon. I thought Wingon was kind of a Pokemon only really Rick has. Guess not. Pixel is 43, wants to learn Light Screen. Nah, I don't learn Light Screen. Aerial Ace. Wow. Let's try Lightning Strike. But Lightning Strike misses. Yay. Please don't. Oh, we outspeed and we go for Ice Beam. Let's go. Let's go, Sal Slam. Yes, Sal Slam. I like it. You're an ace, too. No, I'm above an ace. I'm like a veteran. Not really. Still, I'm, I'm a lot better than you, pathetic ace trainers. Hiker Finley. Cosmet. We're gonna send a pixel lily and we're gonna have him use bug buzz. This is a lot, Jesus. I forgot this thing's part rock type. Oops. But we take that we eat that ancient power. We eat those rocks. Did you know rocks actually have a lot of nutrition to them? You'd be surprised. I'm joking, I they don't. Don't eat rocks, kid that kids that would break your teeth. Um Ruby Op. But just imagine eating rocks. Like, they're Pokemon like uh, Aron that eat rocks. And that's. And to me, I'm like, how do you eat rocks? That just. I guess if your body's made of rocks. Yeah, but then there's Pokemon like uh, Sableye that actually eat like gemstones and like diamonds and rocks. And I'm like, that must be so tough. You're, how, how tough are your teeth to eat a diamond? That's insane. Especially since diamonds like the most. The hardest material in the world. So it's like, that's just insane. Okay, we have like kind of a, a little split right here. A fork in the road. Hey, one little battle before you enter. Oh, so there's like one battle way till we get to Rastic City. Golemo. Okay, let's switch into... Let's go into Ruby Up again. Cause like Sableye is a ghost dark type. Just imagine biting into that's your what your diet consists of gemstones. I mean I guess cause Isn't that kinda why its eyes are like gemstones? I don't really know, but doesn't really sound very tasty. Or nutrition. No. Dracubat, that's another, that's a job for, uh, Petrovolt and his Electro Ball. The way, uh, Ash's Electro Ball in the anime is actually kind of funny, at least the Japanese one. He's like, Electro Ball! It's just, it's just hilarious. Electro Ball's actually kind of good because, uh, Petrovolt's a really fast Pokemon. That's why I didn't want to really get rid of Volt Switch. Okay, so we made it to Rassic City. You know, guys, that's it for this episode. If you like this video, please leave a like and subscribe to become a Cinder Soldier. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.